Hi everybody, my name is Michelle Renee, but everybody calls me Giggles. And a while ago I had a Q&A where somebody asked me if you and the other creepypasta narrators were Greek gods and high school teachers, what would you be? Who would you be? So this is me answering that second part of that question and casting the other creepypasta narrators, at least the ones that I know, as high school subject teachers. <laughs> But I'm kind of digging this, so I might do more. And if there's a category that you want me to cast my other creepypasta friends as, please let me know in the comments and I'll try to do it. So without further ado, let's break some friendships. I already know what I'm going to do. I think it's also fair to say once again that I'm only casting the ones that I know personally. So if your favorite narrator is not here, I'm so sorry. It's only the ones that I know or have a relationship with. So first one's really obvious. Miss Autumn Ivy is the PE coach. There's no other way. There's That's it. Twin skeletons. I, I failed her once in the Greek myth one, but I think that twin skeletons would be an amazing witchcraft and religion teacher for high school students. Do they learn that in high school? They do now. I'm starting to think I put too much highlighter on. Mr. Mew as the music teacher. Super obvious. Super obvious. Oh yeah, 10 out of 10. Mr. Creepypasta is the math teacher. He's smart. He's helped me. I remember when I was still going to college, I really, I desperately needed help for math. And I'd be like, Spike, can you please help me? And he explained it, like in his words, thinking that I could keep up with him and understand. I couldn't, because I'm an idiot, but he's good at math, so he gets the math teacher. Litterbot, if anyone remembers him, could absolutely be the computer science teacher. Not only is his persona and his whole concept perfect for it, but he himself is a smart individual. Haven't talked to him super recently, but he was a really old narrator. Okay, he's not old, but like back in the day, he was pretty relevant. I don't know what he's up to now, but yeah, this is, this is him. I think it's also fair to say that I was homeschooled so I have no idea what they actually teach in a public high school. <laughs> I'm just guessing at this point. Okay, and this one is Mr. Creepypasta's wife. We all call her Rainbow. Home economics, bam! She's the mother of everybody. She makes her own teas. Have you ever ordered one of her teas? They're like Creepypasta and D&D &D themed. They have like their, their original teas with themes on them. And I think her shop is called Ivory Monocle Tea. So yeah, she gets, she earns home economics teacher. Oh no, I bumped Litterbot off. Well, he's not really narrating anymore, so sorry buddy. <laughs> I'd be the drama teacher. 100% I would be the theater teacher of this creepypasta high school. Oh duh, they need to learn English. Who's gonna teach English? Um, mm -hmm. This is gonna sound real obvious at first, but hear me out. Creep says the English teacher. No, it's not because he's English. It's not because he's English. Because I'm thinking, like, here he is, number one, like, going through all these stories, and he can teach kids how to appreciate literature and how to appreciate the English accent. Okay, this might seem really stupid, but I'm putting Stephanie Swan Quills as the English substitute. I know she doesn't narrate creepypasta anymore, but like I've been using people like Litterbot. I've been using people who like haven't narrated in a while anyways. So, so yeah, so she's the English. I'm putting Madame Macabre as the sex ed teacher because she's the only one I trust to teach that course um, without making terrible, terrible, awful jokes about it. But also I just really like the mental image of her like super anxiously or super nervously trying to explain to like an entire classroom of like 40 or so kids <laughs> sexual education. Oh, I should have put Stephanie on history. Oh, and I could have put Madame McCubb on art. <laughs> well, well, they can teach multiple courses. Hold on, let me fix this. And and art. I am so glad I didn't just draw a black permanent marker on my white closet. What else do kids in high school learn? Do high school kids learn psychology or is that just a college thing? Oh, science! Oh no, who's gonna, who's gonna teach them science? Okay, let me see. Um, 
I don't think any of us are qualified to teach science. <laughs> I think we're done here. I think this is what high school would look like for our very prestigious Creepypasta Academy. And Madame Macabre as the sex ed and art teacher. <laughs> That's why there's so many nude statues in the museums. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video and witnessing my awful casting. I hope we're still friends. Let me know in the comments if there's any other categories you guys want to see me cast my creepypasta friends and I as, and I will probably do it. All right, thanks guys. Have a great day. Bye.